Hey besties, welcome back or welcome if you are new. Don't forget to like and subscribe and let's get into today's video. So today I am going to be doing the video a little bit different. I am going to unbox some stuff from Criminal Claws and I'm super excited to show you guys what I got. And then after I unbox the stuff, I am going to let the video just play out and let you guys vibe to some music while I do some swatches. So if you have not heard of Criminal Claws before, they have luxury beginner friendly acrylics and at super affordable prices. She has super fun collections too. The owner's name is Sierra and she is absolutely amazing. I just, I love her to pieces. I love her story. I love her brand. I love what she represents. And if you guys haven't checked her out, you definitely should. Her wordplay on her products is super fun too. She's got sweaters, she's got aprons, she's got all sorts of stuff, and her branding is super cute, so I wanted to share it with you guys. So definitely go check her out if you haven't, because you will love her stuff. I did purchase some of this, but she did throw in some extra goodies for me, so thank you, Sierra. Uh, starting off, we got some mini kawaii charms, and they're super cute. I think she throws this in with like every order, too. And then I got some little gold leaves, and she threw in a couple little extras for me. Those will be super fun for like a 420 set. And then these really cute little charms. These are another one that I purchased. So you get two for a dollar, which is a great deal. I have never seen these ones either, which I just, I don't know. It drew me to them even more because I thought they were super cute. I get like super kawaii vibes from this. Aren't they cute? So the next item she threw in is some loose chunky glitter. And this one is called Funktastic. It's got like little stars and hearts and like what else in it? Flowers, I think. I could have swore I seen some little smiley faces in here, but I could be wrong. Don't quote me on that. But either way, super cute and I'm super excited to test this stuff out. The next thing that she threw in for me was some more chunky glitter and I love this one. This one is called Blow Bubbles. And I love the little reflect pieces in this. I'm super excited to play with this one more. I need to get some low odor monomer though. She has some that's like ambrosia scented. So I want to try that out. But I know the monomer that I show in this video a little more into it. Woo! It is stinky. My husband is like, uh-uh. No more of that. Like... He thought propane was leaking in our house, like it stunk so bad. The next item that she threw in for me is called Poison Putty, and this is her form of the non-stick 3D gel that you can like make charms with and all that different stuff. And she actually had a video explaining why you are able to touch this kind of product. So this is a PVC plastic, and even though you have to cure it like under a UV light, it is not a gel product. So the compound makeup that makes this product is nothing like, like a gel polish or a hard gel or a builder gel. So it being that PVC plastic is what makes it safe to the touch. And this is what her distributor had told her. She said, don't 100% quote her on it but that is what they are telling her. So that's why we are able to touch it. I also just want to point out her packaging for that. I love that it is not just a black jar. I have never seen a pink jar that is like UV protected. So I really like that. Now is the fun part. The main attraction of the show, her acrylics. And you guys, when I tell you these acrylics are everything, they are everything. They are so creamy. They are a slower setting acrylic, so you will actually have time to work with it. But she does say don't use a lot of low odor monomers that are slow setting. Because this is already a slower setting product, it can mess with the way it sets up. So just wanted to mention that. 
I do just want to apologize now if you guys can hear some background noise. I had to kick on the AC because it is 10 p.m. and super hot still. So the two I just showed, the one in the pink and toxic are the two that I bought and then she threw in into the night and ghosted for me to test out. I love that it has this little um, topper piece on it so it doesn't spill in transport. That is awesome. This one is one in the pink and her jars are glass, which is super awesome. I love the little details. This little stopper piece too. Again, the little details. This one is ghosted and look at the glitter, you guys. Oh my goodness. Her acrylics are so pretty and they are super creamy. One of the better, like one of the best acrylics I have ever worked with. This one is toxic and it is a bright pink, but it has like blue reflex in it. It's kind of hard to see on camera, but you will see when I swatch it. And this one is my favorite. It is so pretty. This one is into the night and wait until you guys see the swatch for this. This one is seriously everything. So this was all the stuff that I got from Criminal Claws and we are going to take a quick intermission before swatching and I'm going to show you guys this acrylic brush that I got off Amazon and some monomer really quick as well. So this is a CADS number 12 crimped Kalinsky brush and I heard a lot of really great things about this acrylic brush and I can understand why. When I unboxed it and held it in my hand, the way that the weight is distributed on this brush is amazing. The handle, even though it's wooden, feels very nice. It comes pre-crimped, which we can all always appreciate, I'm sure. So I'm just going to clean it out really quick. I will pop up on screen the monomer that I got. I'm not going to go into great detail about it. Um, but I will leave it linked in the description down below along with all the other products from today's video and Sierra's socials as well. So be sure to check the description box for all that. I am going to let this part play out and just let you guys enjoy the swatching and I will pop back in as needed. So I will see you guys in a couple.
These just so stinking beautiful. I cannot get over how easy these acrylics are to work with. So if you are looking for beginner friendly acrylics that are slower setting, I highly recommend you check out Criminal Claws. Sierra is a pleasure to work with. And again, I will leave everything from today's video listed in the description down below. I hope you guys enjoyed the different style of video today. Be sure to let me know what you thought in the comments. And if you are not subscribed yet, please consider. And that is it for this one. I love you all so much and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!